Hello YouTubers, this is QGod again. This is a update for my dual power TD1010 tablet. Um, I was asked to do a couple of things uh, to see if the show to browse are being used in a full view on a website like um, the New York Times. Uh, they'd run a benchmark test on the tablet. I also wanted to mention that this is a Android version four zero four. So it's it is the latest version. However, this Android uh is locked, so you can't root it. So We'll just have to deal with that. I don't really hold that against them. There's a lot of non-rooted tablets and phones out there. So it's not a big issue for me unless you plan on wanting to run some things that weren't standard on it. Which maybe in time, uh, the people that... Uh, oh, those lovely people at the Android uh, site can probably work on it. Uh, show you the browser here. New York Times can load very well, very quickly. I can read the articles and read it in uh, the different landscape modes. So there's no problem there with this tablet reading web pages full web pages works just fine very very well so I have no issues with that also wanted to show root checker I was pleasantly surprised at how well this thing reads my class 8 SD card and that is some seriously decent speeds for such a small card. But I'm thinking it's testing that uh, flash part. But I haven't been able to prove that just yet. Need to spend some more time on that one. And. I had did the benchmark and that's what came up. which was a decent score so it puts me in the area of the Galaxy Note and the Prime with the score that I got. Now, um, another person suggested that I use the app to SD and generally what you would do is when you load an application on this program here we'll check to see whether or not it's safe to send the SD so you don't store it on your local memory and that saves you a lot of space it's a great program used it for a while when you use 
when you use it on this, however, and it'll go from internal memory and it'll save on its flash instead of actually using the SD card, which is present. I had loaded and stuff myself onto the SD card to just make sure that that works and that it could be read and that works fine. Um, but by default, it's it's going right to the flash memory. So that's the thing that I see happening. Once they correct this, like if they could make uh, the internal space 2 gigs or I would prefer 2 gigs or maybe a gig and a half on top of this 512, we should be fine. And you can, we can load as many programs as we want. Some programs don't want to transfer over to SD or work properly when you do so. So you have to be careful whether or not you take certain programs. reason why I ran out is I average about 60 apps. Currently, right now, I, the max I could put on this so I could have a little bit of available space uh for caching is 36 apps i have running and i'm generally in a 60 app range so i definitely need more space a whole lot more um that's it for so far if i could come up with any other things for you or if you need me to post more information uh about this tablet and how well it is they just need to correct that this is going to be a great tablet once these issues are addressed oh yeah I wanted to show you one thing um, I did notice one another issue uh, this is a a sensory game so you have to move the tablet left to right to move it around and notice that <sighs> That I'm gonna crash. This is a uh, racing moto, and you see how it wobbles. Very hard to stay where you gotta go with it wobbling, and that deals directly with the sensor. It should stay where you tell it to go. Uh, so it's very hard to play this game. I think this is a I think this is an issue that could be fixed with a, a driver, what so have you, update. It's, I don't really think it's a big deal. I have tried to fix it with uh, bar level and calibrate. It lasted for about an hour and then it reset back to this. So that'll be something else that I need to let them know. All right. I uh, hope I was able to answer your questions. Leave more feedback for me and I'll try to post more videos if you need it. Um, and leave good comments for me. Take care. Bye-bye.